talked about how to uh, consume a promise, how to pass on a promise if you're calling an asynchronous function and you just want to pass on its resulting promise. And we've looked at how to create your own promise and return that. In all of these cases, the return value of our asynchronous function is a promise. But what I want to do now is I want to actually do something that, that results in a promise and store that promise somewhere. Video offers a rich and engaging way to connect with your audience, tell your story, and grow your business. And
True voice of Punjab, Jazzy B. Jazzy B. 